All right, everybody, we're back. I'm Harry Potter, look at me, I've got a scar on my head. If you guys hadn't noticed that in the previous videos, I, I, I ran into a uh, clothesline. I literally, not a clothesline tackle, but literally a clothesline in the back of, the, in the, back of the, um, the yard at work. It went bang, straight in my head. It felt a lot worse than what it actually did. Thank God it didn't fucking make a huge gash. But anyways, guys, look, we're here. We're here for something real important. We're in the top 20 players of 2018 for the NFL. We're going to crack into number 18, guys. 18, Ben Roethlisberger. Now, this is a man that I have seen uh, only in this top 100 series. I've seen him speak. I've seen what he looks like. He looks like a character. And I really want to sort of, um, I really want to watch this. So let's do that. Let's just change this up a tiny little bit here. Get the angle right. Uh, that painting is really going to piss me off. I'm staying in an Airbnb, guys. I'm down in Melbourne. I live in Alice Springs, but I'm in Melbourne at the moment. So, I'm down here on a little bit of business. If you do follow my channel enough, you'll know why. But in the meantime, let's get into this. How about the, the greatest? Uh, well, that's his quarterback, isn't it? The greatest. Oh, what is, man, you know I'm showing, I'm showing you major love up here, Ben. I'm giving you major love, baby. Let's go, Ben. He still has an arm. I don't think you lose that. <laughs> that is so good. It's amazing. That was a great catch. I think people kind of sleep on the That's not in, surely. Oh, oh, my gosh. Ben Roethlisberger, shocking, he made a great throw. Who, after contemplating retirement last offseason, oh. Ben Roethlisberger returned to... It's Will Ferrell! <laughs> it's Step Brothers! With 1,000 yards and 28 touchdowns. He has so many weapons that he... he How many yards? 4,000 4, yards 4, and yards. 28 touchdowns. He ain't he retiring. So weapons that he utilizes all of them. Play the Bell, Antonio Brown! Bell and Brown. He's got to play tight coverage and just hope that he has an off day. The Ravens secondary felt the wrath of Roethlisberger in week 14 when he notched the third oh! passing game of his career. The only quarterback in NFL history to accomplish that feat. What? Week 14. Oh. When he notched the third 500 yard passing game of his career. Third 500 yard passing. Imagine throwing for 500 yards. Holy shit. Your team must have had a lot of possession to do that, surely. The only quarterback in NFL history to accomplish that feat. Wow, it's the only one. That's awesome. He's got a record. He's just laser focused and he controls the offense where he calls his own plays. Um, literally, we had a screenplay to the left. Then it was supposed to throw to me. But obviously, there's pressure. He sees that someone's on me. So, what's he going to do? Run? So, he runs the ball. Yes, nice. Nice. Fake the pitch. The dude bit. Oh! <laughs> that is a dummy pass. That is the equivalent of a dummy pass in the game of rugby. That is sick. I love that. Let me watch it again. So he runs the ball. In the middle of like mid play, he's like Juju. Fake the pitch. The dude bit. And Ben went for like 10 more yards. So good. He's, he's shifting too. I mean, he's got a little. little I like that. A little backyard football. That's a dummy pass. You're dummying, you're dummying the, the pitch, and you go yourself. I don't know why you don't use that more often, man. But as a rugby player, defending that, we're taught to stay on your man. Don't fall for the dummy. Do not fall for it. But that defender fell for it. Ben's brains were responsible for the longest pass completion in Steelers history. 105 yards. 98 yards. Before that play, actually, we went inside the locker room. I was like, Ben, you know, when I run the seam route, instead of me, you know, going out and in, I'm going to just go straight in and just try to beat him over the top. And we go, we go out there, literally, we get the same coverage, the same play, and I did exactly what I told him I was going to do. Go just go straight in. in yeah. and just try to beat Ooh. him over the top. He delivered the ball, and I went uh, 97 yards. 
He saw the defense. He says, Juju, look. A perfect throw this time from Ben. He wasn't even looking that way. He was looking to the right. The ball was already in, his, in the air. Look. He says, Juju, look. A perfect he's looking, he's looking right. And the ball is thrown right. Okay, so he sees it. He sees it come out of his hands. Just. Ben. Just. Guy's a warrior, man. It's an honor to play with him. You know, I guess. I like this up. guy. It's an honor to play with him. Look at this guy, man. I like this. He's got a fucking killer smile, doesn't he? I don't know about those eyes, man. Those eyes are intense. He's got such a good demeanor, this guy. You know, I guess this, this old cowboy's got a little bit left in him. There's your quote. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, I've got to watch that guy. I've got to see um, a special on him. But we're not going to do that right now. Nick Minnett. Oh, ho, 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 right, everybody. <laughs> what is going on? Welcome back to another video. Today, would you shout out? Alright, the jug is boiling, we've got the cup, but no coffee, it's 8 in the morning, and you guys might not know this, I don't know when this video is going to come out, but today is the day that I finish the top 100. I've been hustling, I've been down in Melbourne on holiday, I didn't have a lot else to do other than check out my first football game and have a meeting with my manufacturer for my clothes. Other than those two things, I had four days free, and the way I've used them is to get through the top 100. I've gone from 70, no, from 80, or from 75, down to like 18, okay? We're at number 17 right now, Jalen Ramsey. We're gonna start with him. I'm gonna get the screen recorder going. I'm gonna make myself a quick coffee, and we're gonna crack into this because we're nearly there, and I never, ever, ever, ever thought I'd make it. And we have, nearly. But we've still got 17 more to go, so let's do this. GPS signal lost. Oh, oh, that's, that's not very good. Okay. GPS signal lost. Oh, okay. GPS signal lost. You know what, I'm really looking forward to this top 17, because, you know, <laughs> they're going to be the best players in the league and these are probably going to be the players that I've been that I've been told to do reactions to which are here which I you know individual players which I haven't actually done yet so if they come up it'll jog my memory I'll, I'll sort of put a face to a name and then in another time I can do the actual reaction to the individual person because I do want to do that so anyways guys Let's crack into this, all right? 17, Jalen Ramsey, cornerback for the Jaguars. I can imagine what sort of trash talk I'm going to hear here, but let's do it. Just like, you know, he knows how good he is. I'm not strong enough. Ah, uh, fuck off! <laughs> not strong enough, Putin. Oh, my fucking God. I would have given him shit back just then. Ah, shout out. You ain't strong enough. <laughs> Come on, bruh. Show me some more. I'll shut my mouth for the rest of this, all right? <laughs> That's the guy you want on your team. You know, a cornerback. Let's go, Ramsey. Andrew, who's great fundamentals. That's Jalen Ramsey. For you to talk. Nor the Tom Brady, that let me know you out of your mind. <laughs> Ain't nobody talking noise to 12. Not before the game anyway. The guy never have his mouthpiece in his mouth because he always talking. You look at He's him, a cornerback. Yeah, yeah. Snap his mouth I thought he was a safety him. actually. He gonna have his mouthpiece out of his mouth. He gonna let it hang. That's how I know Ramsey. When he's on the field. He's going to talk to you all game. He's going to get in your ears, get in your head, get you out of your game. And that's what he does. Oh, is that Edelman? Get in your ears, get in your head, get you out of your game. And that's what he does. No. Amendola. Oh, no problem. We're going to beat your 
All right, who, how tall is this Jalen Ramsey, man? Would he be standing up to me like that? <laughs> is he tall? He is six foot one. Okay. Hey, what's up with him and dog? Why do you act like that? Because of you. I hear you or something. I love that because you want a guy who's like confident, who has that swagger. You ain't getting started. Shut your ass up. I mean, he talks about it to everyone he's on the field against. <laughs> Gronk. Hey, you can't win me, Gronk. Hey, Gronk. Hey, baby. Let's go. <laughs> he speaks for himself. Um, and his play speaks for itself, and he's a, a, a phenomenally gifted athlete. He had an interception against me. Good coverage in the secondary, and the ball is intercepted by Jalen Ramsey. Stay in. I went up for my post route, nodded at the top to see if I could get him to move a little bit. He didn't move. Very disciplined. So that's a post. He's going to the post, to the corner post. He does a nod, which is a, a step to the center. So it's a post nod center. <laughs> and in that sequence, he made a great play on the ball. But no, nah, Ramsey's too fast, too tall. Nice catch. Nice tackle. What's that, Jaguar, Jacksonville Stadium? Clock is 34, and here it goes. Peterman drops the throw, throws it out to the right side. Get there, Ramsey. Off by Ramsey. Nice work. He's a game changer. That's been. It was just an interception. Proven, uh, and people forget this only his second year. Watch your helmet. <laughs> Fuck, look at those guys. They're fucking moving out of the way. They don't know what he's going to do. All right, man, Jalen Ramsey, I cannot wait to see you play this season. I cannot wait to see what shit you're going to talk this season. So let's crack into number 16. Khalil Mack. Another name I've heard, but I haven't looked at. Defensive end for the Raiders. Let's do this. I haven't seen someone from the Raiders for ages. He takes our poor right tackle, picks him up with one arm, and sets him in my lap. I was like, oh my. Yeah, you don't see that pass rush very many times in the Mountain West, you know. <laughs> uh, so that was, that was new for me. How big is this guy? <laughs> oh, number five last year. Oh no. Khalil is somebody who is obviously freakishly gifted. Talented, strong, fast. Sorry mate, we're gonna have to, have to start that again, I think. Okay. All of those. Somebody who is obviously freakishly gifted. Talented, strong, fast. Talented, explosive. strong, fast, All of those explosive. Things. There are a lot of people that have those qualities. He takes those things and he outworks everybody. He knows formation get there, Mac. and route concepts. You know, you get that from a middle linebacker like Keekley and those guys. But to do it from a defensive end spot, he's calling out plays before they're even happening. He doesn't need to know those things, but he does. And when you get a guy that's that talented, and has that kind of knack for the game, he's a walking Hall of Famer. The 2016 NFL Defensive Player of the Year, Raiders defensive end Khalil Mack, was almost as unstoppable in 2017. And it was a Mack truck. If Mack you know truck. If you're going to pass the ball, there's nobody in this league, no two guys in this league that can stop him at all. I mean, I've seen him throw a tight end off, run over a tackle, and then bring down a quarterback. 
The Mac attack. Fuck He's no. Got the round shell and the chip block by Forte. That's incredible. Beating two guys. So he is going after their, so their right tackle is going to have to sort this guy out, whereas the left tackle is sorting out this number He's got the 27, it seems. That you always have to be aware against. But the left tackle is the most important, is that right? Because he, because most quarterbacks are right-handed, so they're, they're facing this way. And, you know, on their blind side, that left tackle is, is going to be keeping them safe. Whereas if they were left-handed quarterbacks, would their right tackle be the most important? Let me know. It's a little more heavy footed, but then there's the speed, so you have to be more light footed, so it's kind of like pick your poison. Max has such a great low center of gravity that when a tackle gets high on him trying to run back with him, he always has the advantage. Anytime you try to jump the guy, he's going to make you miss. One player they show a lot is the guy from uh, Kansas City. Taylor Luan. Hang on, man, this camera's really fucking me off. This painting in the background is just. Um, ah, I knew we'd get there eventually. A little shake, guy opens up his chest, tries to bear arm him, and just the long arm right into the back of the quarterback. Look at Kilio Mack. He's so he's on the right now. Number one, Vic Eric Fisher away. And power go down, son. I'm going to the corner. Whoa! How good is this guy? Jeez. He loves when people like to compare him. Oh, he's one of the best, those kind of things. He wants to be known as the best. Hey, lay it all on the line today. Well, you better start talking. He every matchup. He wants to dominate every game. Be a Ray Lewis. A game record and a game changer is coming on back. But he's never going to stop until he is the best. That's who you want on your team. That is definitely who you want on your team. All right. Oh, here we go. Now, we, now we're talking. Rob Gronkowski. Rob so is definitely a top 100 player. Wait! But I think he got injured. Is that right? I think so. Rob does things that wide receivers do. Makes the grab at the 40. Rob does things that tight ends do. I haven't seen this guy for quite a while. Gr Gronkowski, Gronk, was uh, one of my first ever suggested videos. And one of my first videos I ever did. And um, still one of my favorites, actually. So I haven't seen him for ages, but I definitely know who he is. He's 87 for the Patriots. Let's crack into it. These things that offensive linemen do. First man is into the end zone. Touchdown, Patriots! Rob is a man of many talents. Hmm. Ah. Oh. This is Rob Gronkowski's seventh consecutive top 100 selection. And the fifth time, he's been the top-rated tight end. Now, what does something like that on your, on your arm, on your elbow, do? Is it to make it not bend? Well, hang on. 21, 25. 21 in his first year. 25, 41, 10, 9, and 23. And now he's at 15. That is some consistency. Wow. I think his mindset, when he takes the football field, is I want to be the best player on the field. I want to go dominate the game. And no! No! I'm activated! I'm ready! <laughs> Gronk's activated! 1,084 receiving yards in 2017. How many? And with 1,000... Activated! I'm ready! Gronkowski led all tight ends with 1,084 receiving yards in 2017. Whoa! Over 1,000 yards! You're fucking joking me! And it's not only in the passing game, he wants to dominate in the run game. Far up. He wants to impose his will on the opponent every time he takes the field. Sometimes you see Rob on film, he's in a tackle stance, pass blocking on the team's best pass rusher. I actually think he likes doing it. A lot of tight ends don't want to do it, but he actually kind of relishes the moment where he can maybe drive you back. He had a play maybe three or four years ago where he actually drove, might have been a safety, like out the end zone. <laughs> him right off the field you came off the field and we're doing this like he's been talking to me this whole game and it was revenge time yes he was just yapping to me the whole time and uh that's why i took him and threw him out of the club yeah <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah he had tennis shoes on was trying to get in that's not allowed if it's a fact you won't 
Yeah, go Gronk. When he gets going and he kind of, you know, goes into that beast mode that he's got. James Develin, Patriots fullback. I've never seen him before, but I've got to say, don't mind the old beard there, mate. Not bad, not bad. I mean, it's it's infectious. Everyone feels that energy. Holy shit! Devel Develin, Develin is massive. <laughs> Gonna go up in, you know, Mossum. Mossum. Uh, yeah, you know, Moss, Randy Moss. You know, he coined that term. He wants it for Moss. And Randy got yeah. another great catch! Also, Gronk be is very strong and, and he's good with his body control. Using his body to keep the distance between the defender and the, and the ball. Back shoulder left for Bramkowski. Makes a twisting one handed catch! Touchdown! Oh, hang on. So, let's have a look at his stats and just imagine him as a wide receiver. So, six foot six, nearly two meters, and 270 pounds, basically playing as a wide receiver. What the fuck? You tell me a cornerback that can mark that shit. There ain't one, right? There's just not. <laughs> Depending on his speed, of course. Mmm. Sweet, man. Alright. Well, that's that video done. I want to say if you have enjoyed this one, as always, hit the like button. If you want to subscribe, please do. And I'll be back here very shortly for uh, the next one. Number 14, 13, and 12 from the top 100 players of 2018.